Hey everybody, it's Mara from Matter Hackers, and this is your Matter Hackers Minute. Here at Matter Hackers, we get super excited when we find people using 3D printing for finished, usable parts. When those parts are used for education, that's even better. And when the education is for students who are blind or visually impaired, well, you get your own video. Let's talk about Neil McKenzie. He's an assistive technology specialist for the visually impaired department at the Sonoma County Office of Education. He uses 3D printing to make lessons more accessible for K-12 students who are blind or low vision. We first came across Neil's work when he submitted two models to our Envision the Future Design Challenge last spring, this quadrant math grapher, and a braille learning game. But Neil had been researching the possibilities for years prior. He eventually purchased a Lulzbot TAS-5 and started designing functional tools in Tinkercad to be printed in basic PLA and ABS. These prints help students to be more independent in accessing specific concepts or assignments, saving Neil and his Braillist a lot of time repeating and explaining things in the classroom. The students can really keep up with a lesson being taught by their regular teacher by using a 3D printed math manipulative or working through written problem solving assignments with models of trains and barns to follow up with written story problems. Neil even 3D printed a guide to help a younger student with a visual impairment and cerebral palsy to help write his name. This helped the student reach his individualized education program goal and gave him a huge confidence boost. This is very exciting, Neil would like to see more collaboration between the maker movement and accessibility. 3D printers with simple audio output and intuitive 3D modeling software designed for those with visual impairments would allow his students to participate fully in this learning process. For more information on Neil and his programs, and to access a full library of models designed for the visually impaired, click the links below. Are you using 3D printing for accessibility? Leave me a comment and we just might feature your work in an upcoming video. I'm Mara and this has been your Matter Hackers Minute. Go be awesome. Thank you for watching. If you liked that, subscribe to our channel to keep up to date with all of our videos. And remember, go to matterhackers.com to shop for everything 3D printing.